I was I was online last night uh, just watching the greatest fucking thing ever. Mm. My video's and Oh, Jimmy, I was, you ruined the surprise. That's what I was going to say. <laughs> it was um, Stairway to Stardom. This was a show that was on cable access right. back in uh, the late 70s, early 80s. This fucking creepy guy ran it. And it's so cheesy, and it's all these New Yorkers. It's like a talent show. It's America's Got Talent for New York uh, back in the um, 70s uh, and, and 80s. So incredibly bad. Where is it? Well, I tweeted a bunch of uh, links. Any of the links I tweeted late last night, uh, you have to see. The comedians are my favorite, and the impressionists. So let's get a clip of the, the comedians greatest. or an impressionist. Uh, let's see. It, that, that guy. Oh, oh, we need some volume. Yeah, and I need the to one see you it. Sam looks like he's watching TV yeah. at home. Feet up. That guy runs the, the show. The guy on the right. Yeah. He looks like he touches kids. Oh, this is a dancer. Huh? Don't go to the dancer yet. Okay. I mean, we we got to get a, uh, some audio more All than right. visual. So go down to um, this guy. You come Is that it? No, no, no. No, keep going. One more. Sorry. Uh, okay. Yeah. Lauren McCall is fucking right. ninety. Try. Jesus. No. This will be late. Fuck. Oh, maybe that guy. Yeah, go 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 to that guy. See what he's doing. Let's bring out Wayne Rubin, everybody. He's a comedian. Thank you. You know this guy? Potted plant behind him. Thank you. As you know, every year Jerry Lewis has a telethon for muscular dystrophy, and of course it's a very worthwhile cause. But what would happen if he had a telethon for dandruff? I think we'd go something like this. All right, here we are on our 24th hour for dandruff, and so far we have reached a total of a dollar. A dollar in 24 hours? I have here a letter from the President of the United States says, Dear Jerry, good luck in your fight against dandruff. What's the matter, Ray? You couldn't send a few dollars with the letter? <laughs> and now from the Middle East, I'd like to bring out, here's Menachem Begin. Menachem, come on out here. Louis, Louis, where is he, Louis? He ain't here? Uh, Menachem couldn't be with us, so instead I'd like to bring out the voice of racing, Fred Capicella. <laughs> Thank you, Jerry. The horses are on the track. It is now post time. <laughs> Chip loves it. In this guy's race, good. fat lady, ten pounds over, <laughs> and it's cabbage by a head. Thank you, Fred. And now from Jackie Gleason's American Scene magazine, here's Joe the bartender and Crazy Guggenheim. Oh, uh, how you doing, Donna? He all crazy shows in the back. I'll call him out. Hey, Craze. Hi, Joe. Hello, Mr. Day. <laughs> you like it, Chip? This fucking guy sounds just like him. I wasn't doing nothing. <laughs> oh, this guy. <laughs> now, the voice of the late, great Nat King Cole singing the Christmas song. My mother loved him. And now he just sings the rest of the song. Chestnuts it. roasting on an open This fire. is Stairway to Stardom. People may not Jack realize Fox this is all one guy doing all those things. Oh, I know. Yeah. You might not realize it. Home. Otherwise, yeah. that is El Escalator to Obscurity. Yes. <laughs> all right, enough for him. Go to, this, yeah, you're wow. fucking jealous because he sounds like the people. I know. I am. He's wow. a garbage. Go to, uh, yeah, there's another impressionist. I hope you can find him. <laughs> oh, oh, I think this guy is... Oh, yeah. Uh, ha -ha, it just gets better. Every, oh, this guy rolls. Yeah, maybe him. Johnny Gallagher. Yes. This hey, guy Johnny. is the great. He I has think. nothing. Glad to see him. Oh, I've seen this before. He's you know, great. ladies and gentlemen, that Jerry Cooney and Larry's home fight was really Larry's something. Larry's home, home fight. He's the a little politicians nervous. were in a fight game. It goes something like this. And now, Howard Cosell. Oh, good. Well, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. With me, the former president of the United States, Jimmy Carter. Jimmy, you do look beat. Oh, no. Well, I fought every top contender, but I promise <laughs> that I will be back next year, and I will win with the help of my brother Billy. Thank you. Okay, we take you now to Las Vegas, where we have Jack Nicholson with Ronnie oh, Reagan. Jack. This is going to be good. How the hell are you, Howie? It's so good to see you. Oh, God! And with me Chip is, is the fucking guy's good. You never look so good. Well, 
I'm just a rough, tough cream puff. And you know, I'll meet him next time. I'll meet Jimmy or Henry. Now back, oh now here we go God, live with it's... Henry Kissinger. Henry, he's amazing. He's, he's here at the studio. I want to tell you the truth. They used to beat me up all the time. Dick Nixon, all of them. I want to fight everybody. Okay, let's go with Rocky Balboa oh, and fuck Richard yeah. Nixon. Rocky, what's the matter with you, huh? You don't like my friend? You think he can't fight? How embarrassing is this? Uh, this is so bad. Come on, uh. Rich, yeah? I could watch this guy for an hour. Yes, I last night I was going just it's going through best. all these clips. He's doing his Richard Nixon. My my fellow Americans. Let me make this perfectly clear. Look at the drummer in the background. <laughs> it looks like Norman Fell. I'm really doing this. No laughs from the drummer. No. He's just waiting for his Cary turn to Grant drum. Cary Grant fighting. Cary Grant. It's the worst backdrop ever. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Put up your hands. Come on, fight me, fight me. Well, Enough yes, of the fight yes. thing. What? Is Alfred Hitchcock Oh, good. Fighting. Oh, Jesus. He's bombing <laughs> terribly. Why don't you fight me up three o'clock? Well, thank you. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. You've been a gracious audience. Thank you. Now he, he's so good. It's like Carson when Carson pulled over you know, a comic. I, I, I asked talks the, to the host. <laughs> uh, the same one. Can you do something that nobody else does? Sure. Kill yourself. You can? Three voices that nobody has ever done on TV. Oh. Okay, here's mine. Okay. Roger Moore. I say there, Daniel. How are you? Nice to see you. <laughs> Hello, this is James Bond. <laughs> Al Pacino. You even sound British. Pacino. No Look, one does Al Pacino. I don't want to see you get hurt. You know what I mean? So if you want to listen to me, do what you want. And Squiggy of Laverne and Shirley. Hello. Uh, this is Squigman and his friend Lenny. And we come to Chicago to see Laverne. <laughs> what is that? That gets the applause break. You know, you make me look short. You know uh, that, don't you? <laughs> this guy's got charisma, the host, though. Uh, uh, holy shit. Whatever happened to that guy? His name's I Johnny would, Gallagher. I would love to know what happened to, to all Johnny these Gallagher. people. I, I must have watched huh. 20 or 25 clips what? from this show. What? Just the whole thing. So if that's a bad. hard one to Google. Johnny Gallagher is kind of a common name. Yeah. Try. Let's, oh, let's there's Google the him. opener. Oh. Play the opener of the show. <laughs> oh, look my at this. God, are look at this. Listen to their New York accent. <laughs> Stay tuned because Stairway to Stardom is next with Frank Massey. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the big opener. <laughs> It's some glittery fucking. They got a song. You know, you see tomorrow. You could put this show as is on a dump swim on Cartoon Network. Yes! And it would work. Yes. Brighten up your day. We've got singers and dancers and actors performing. Ventriloquism. Listen to this song. Oh, there he goes. He made the highlight reel. Stay with the stardom. Stay with the stardom. The camera angles and the, the fades uh, to try to make it look like a real variety show. Did any of these people make it? I no. haven't seen one person. In the open, we've seen a lot of people we've never heard of before. Yes. And the stage is so, with that backdrop, <laughs> I'd rather do comedy in front of something that said Tawid and Jihad behind it. <laughs> 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 they pop his face up on it. Yeah, it's uh, Stairway to Stardom. A lot, a lot of clips online. Yeah, that guy's rocking. Here, let's see one more. You got oh one more? Yeah, yeah, see. let's uh, go one back more. down. One more. Find one I tweeted uh, that was a little lower than one more. Than that one. Um, just fr Better friend said she was hilarious. Oh, yeah, this is another comic, a comedian. <laughs> Guess what? Anyway, I just came to New York recently. You know her? Paul, what's her name? Excuse me. Is that Fran Capo? No, Cheryl Klein. Cheryl Klein. Klein. Don't know. You don't know Cheryl, Cheryl Klein. Klein? You should know her, man. She's she funny. Might, she might be Jewish. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, oh I yeah. bet you she is a JKB. My mother always said, Chipper, watch out for them. They're going to take your money. <laughs> what? <laughs> My mother said, if you want to see how many Jewish people there are, roll a penny out, Chipper. They'll <laughs> oh, run God. for it and clunk their heads. <laughs> you should be on this show. <laughs> I'm not originally from New York. I came here like a lot of you people looking out there, a lot of you cesareans, to make it big in show business. Nothing. I gave myself three weeks 
I have two hours left. Two hours? No, an hour and four minutes. Anyway, no, I'm gonna make it fine. If I don't make oh. it here, honey, In case I'll go back to visit my mother in yeah. Miami because I got a letter from my father, a telegram yesterday. Come to Miami. I said, Daddy, I'm not coming to Miami. She drives me nuts. He said, Cheryl, your mother went to a change of life. She's gonna start living hers instead of mine. <laughs> Now listen, my mother, well, maybe you know her, she's the queen of denial, the uh, love goddess of King's Highway, God bless this lady, but she identifies with major characters of the Bible, like last Thursday she had a Moses complex. You know how Moses led the Israelites out of Egypt? My mother had a similar experience, she led our family circle out of an a &S white sail. A &S. I said, Ma, I have no room for the sheet. She said, wear them. I said, I look like the Ku Klux Klein. Mm. She said, wear the sheet, just don't know how to break your head. Daddy, leave me alone. Tell her to leave me alone. Cheryl, don't call your mother she. This is a, <laughs> the story of my life. I go to Miami. It's She's happy. Her, She's living she. in a condominium. Yeah. Maybe you've heard of it. Yenta Towers. Oh, she <laughs> makes a <laughs> face. Oh. I'm so embarrassed to tell my friends where I'm going. Begging She's sitting on a, a gold dining room. You know, she says, have a little schnapps. I said, Ma, what are you schnapsing me? She, you, I, she said, sit down and join in the activity. I said, what's the activity? <laughs> sitting down and watching Gidget Coast Kosher on a purple velveteen couch, you know. Gidget Good microphone, Kosher. too. <laughs> Unbelievable. She has a pool in the shape of a mouth. This is so bad. The lifeguard can't swim. They pay him to listen. <coughs> My daughter, the Meshuggah, she moved out of the house. She thinks she calls? So she calls twice a day. Big deal. That's way that. Unbelievable. My mother used to sing me a lullaby. It went something like this. Go to sleep, my flesh and blood. Go to sleep, my chubby child. I'll stay up for a while. To work my fingers to the bone, oh. to give you and your son of a, your, your fat and great brother Larry a nice home. Oh, she's oh, great. Oh, great. Oh, she's great. How oh, fucking horrid. The they had. That's all I want to oh, do is watch wow. this. I, I she, love it. Yeah, yeah. Find, find one more underneath uh, that one on my. Um, she said son instead of brother. She <laughs> fucked everything oh, up. Oh, she <laughs> nervous on the big show. Oh, God. Uh, I wonder yeah. where this was shot. Uh, yes, yeah, somewhere in in the city. Early I'm 80s. Sure. Oh, Those this are... guy, it's a singing act. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I hate the way this guy says Our cabaret. Is that? He's singing cabaret. Fine singer, let's bring him Fine. out. Jimmy S Swatsman, right? Here he is, Jimmy Swatsman. At least the host has style. Look yeah, at he's this good. guy. Looks like Seinfeld. <laughs> Wait, this is this is real? Oh yeah, this is serious. What could is sitting <laughs> Look at him, he's all dramatic. <laughs> Come hear the music play. Come to the cabaret. Yeah. <laughs> Come to the cabaret. Look at the cuts. Put down <laughs> the guy's fingers on the piano. Yeah. Look in the room. Come hear the music. Play. Come to the cabaret. <laughs> I was fixated on this. Oh, what a toothy ass. Why? Come to the band. Come blow your horn. Start celebrating right this way. Your table's waiting. <laughs> uh oh. No. Bring it down. Where's the camera going? <laughs> A double shot in this rosacea <laughs> cheeks. <laughs> that is so bad. Come to the cabaret. Looks like he has the dumb and dumber chip too. What's that? The cabaret old jump. To the dumb and dumber. To the cabaret. I could not stop watching uh, the last you? night. What about the magic act? They oh, there is a magician. Yeah. Uh, yes, a magician. He's he's a little awkward. I don't think that's him from the show though. There's another one of uh, Jimmy Schwartzman. I see that's Jimmy Schwartzman. Wait, he got yeah. two songs on the Why show. Why wouldn't he? All right, put two him appearances because he's dressed appearance. differently. Uh, yeah. Jimmy Schwartzman, everybody. Schwartz. Schwartzman. Schwartzman. Jimmy Schwartzman. 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 This is delightful color. Wow. Wow. Oh, nice great. shirt. It's a little more like a star this time. Blind guy in the back of the floor. There is a brotherhood <laughs> of man. Man. Brotherhood of man. A noble tie that binds all human hearts and minds. <laughs> <laughs> he touches his Into head like mines. 
Oh, he, uh oh, they're, they're going for the split screen. And oh, there it is. Oh, you can tell the camera goes way over to one side. Long membership is free. Wow. The kids turn to the side. I think Bartlett sang this song in How to Succeed. Did he? This is from How to Succeed in Business. Oh. He did much, much better than I would hope so. Also, the setting was much more appropriate. Brotherhood of mine. Cabaret. Guy's great teeth. Does he have a sword on his sword? He's got a sword. He's got a sword. 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 It looks like he does. (laughs) 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 He appears to. (laughs) Well, he probably was nervous in the dressing room. He had an outbreak. (laughs) (laughs) There's hundreds of people watching. (laughs) 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 There's a big cold sword on his lip. Holy shit! His brightest shirt with the biggest collar open in his scratch. Oh my god. Oh, who's gotta use that mic next? And the, he's got a giant And the band behind him couldn't look more like dead people. The trumpet player is like relaxing against the wall. He's just chilling out. The smattering of applause and this is no PFG TV. No, no, it's not. What's his name? Let's, let's, can we Google him? That By the way, singer. we got to get Scorch on the show, man. He lost yeah, his game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. got to talk to the Scorch. Let's Google yeah, that know. singer. I want to know where he is. Where Jimmy Schwartz. Jimmy Schwartz. This is 1982, that Schwartzman. one was. Schwartzman. Wow. That's, so that's 30 years ago. Oh 31 years ago. He's probably running fucking the Schwartzman law firm. Yeah. Schwartzman Whoa. fucking. Yeah. What? This is it's from 2006. No way. He's still doing it. No way. Come on. Jimmy is here. That's him. Where did they fucking find him? Handheld. It's amazing. I gotta get him on the show. That's him, all right. He's getting up to sing. (laughs) (laughs) Oh Oh my god. They fucking. 2006. Yeah. (laughs) I hope he says it the same way. Tim, I'm so glad he didn't die in 9-11. Yeah, that would have been terrible. He's not that 2006, bad. 2006, he's back. He's not as bad. He doesn't seem to be um, full of that um, youthful exuberance <laughs> no, no, anymore. No, he's no. been beaten down by life. <laughs> he thought he was going to be a fucking singer. A he's Broadway star. beaten down. <laughs> yeah, well... Uh, Go listen to our old tapes. He's the assistant to the assistant manager at a movie theater. Cabaret. Wow. Is there any more? Come to How long the was that show on? Cab- Is that him in the middle? That's him, That's yeah. Him. I guess wow. they did some kind of uh, reunion Oh, man. Thing. What, Stairway to Stardom reunion? Yeah. <laughs> Stairway to Stardom reunion. Wow. wow. That's fucking great. Go back to the original stair- Stairway to Stardom. Yeah, Let's where's... Uh, Maybe we where- can find one you haven't watched yet. Yeah, 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 yeah. One I know more. there's some uh, more singing and dancing. Let's see what's down below. <laughs> That's wonderful. What do we got? What's our choices here? Oh, another Horror. comedian. Um, oh! Yeah, let's go comedian. That's the guy down there in the middle. No, Yeah, that guy. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Who's Don me? Costello. Don Costello. Don Costello, I know. You know Don Costello? I do know Don Costello. Where's well, he? Said, this Never says it's an <laughs> interview. <laughs> interview? Well, yeah. well maybe it's not a real but interview. I'm sure he does a you few jokes. Do. I think we should Who is she? Die. Don Costello. I really do. You mean on the level? On the level. We huh? haven't done it, and people want to know about him. Okay, hey, Don. Full screen, please. Come on, Don. Why don't you yeah. get here right in between us here? Oh, you don't well. mind stepping out of character, Fuck. do you? No. I just kind of miss a little. You know, we've known Don for several years now, and uh, and uh, just recently we we found out that he's been making movies and everything. Uh, really? Tell us. You're really modest. Tell us a little about yourself, Don. Well, I was in Guys and Dolls. I uh, played Harry the Horse, the Gangster, and the Poor Soul, and the Barry Mission. 
Then I was in Stuck on You, the first turn on. He looks familiar. Avenger, which is playing now. Yes. And uh, the uh, I played in the Intoxicated Butler in the first turn on, which I just mentioned. And uh, I had a lot of fun doing it because I love to make people laugh. And <laughs> if I see a smile on their face, it makes me happy. Fuck oh, yeah. I hope to do that. Years <laughs> that <part. laughs> yeah. well, you know, What's with the well, backdrop? There's more people like you, Don, in this world. It'd be a better place to live in. Believe me. Don Costello. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that was he a good looked, interview. He looked yeah. deeply depressed. Yeah, yeah. Wonder whatever happened to him. Oh, here's a little, uh, you like this? little duet, L little duo. Robert F. Amico and Sue Veneer. God, not one name we know. Nothing. No. <laughs> they never went on to anything. Sue went on to a successful teeth fixing business. <laughs> <laughs> Did she? Yes. Yes. Souvenir. Souvenir. <laughs> yes. See, either that or people would take her home to remember things yes, by. That's exactly. <laughs> Get it? Souvenir. All right. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen. I act, can you pause this? I've heard this song. Robert. This is called I'm a Cunt. Oh. oh yes. well. <laughs> I'm a Cunt. <laughs> take a listen. <laughs> Oh. And souvenir. Zappa. It's fucking me in the 80s. <laughs> right. Terrific. That looks like Frank Zappa. Is that Zappa? Yeah, it looks no. like Zappa. We up to the mountains. We made love till dawn. Two bodies pressed together, yeah. In total one. <laughs> <laughs> They're trying to. So the story goes. I love you, babe. What happened? Who knows? <laughs> this is so bad. I know. I wonder how many people thought they said Juno's and got offended. <laughs> <laughs> now we're not together. I miss those summer nights. Massage your tensions away. You said it felt right. Was this supposed to be like a meatloaf song? Like Sunny and Cher uh, Paradise almost. by the Dashboard Light? In bed by one. Come on, admit it, babe. It was fun. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. This is so incredibly bad. <laughs> <laughs> the writing's amazing. Yeah, it really is. Oh man. Oh, he's rocking now. Oh. <laughs> Wonder where you are now. Oh. Don't see you no more. The last time I spoke to you, we were at war. Hey. <laughs> we're not friends. We're not love. Vision of the past, the summer of '83 went fast. Summer '83 went fast. That's it. That's it. Wow, that was stink a row. My special guest, Precious Tap. Oh no, this she does a dramatic thing. Love in you <laughs> is easy oh. cause nice, you're uh, beautiful. Little mini Ripperton. Yeah. Making love with you is all I want to do. Loving you. Uh oh, goes up high. I see the sun oh. come shining oh, through. She's not going to hit the notes. No. And every time that we. Uh -huh, <laughs> every time we. Uh huh. With you. Here it comes. Ooh. Here it comes. <laughs> she said, fuck that shit. Grandpa, I'm singing Minnie Ripper and Grandpa. <laughs> Love and you is easy cause you're beautiful. La 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 la. La 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 la. <laughs> oh, oh, she didn't even fucking try it. No. Please play that part again. <laughs> you gotta get the end of that again. Oh, please. that was the greatest. Please. Oh. 
Oh, oh. Uh. <laughs> oh shit. Uh. It was awful. Uh. <laughs> Making love with you <laughs> is all shining through. And every time that we uh -huh, <laughs> love with you. I love this. That's all that's up there. <laughs> Why would you even choose the song? Why? Yes, that's the wrong song. To it's, sing. it's known for those notes, yeah. so you have to do them. Everybody's waiting for that one part. That's why no one does that song. Yeah, that's the only reason you would listen to that. Oh dumb my song. god, that's hilarious. Precious Taft has been on other ones though. I saw her doing a dramatic reading. She's literally crying her eyes out. Really? Her face and snot running down her nose. She got fucking yeah, yeah. Does anyone remember this show? And sometimes he was cinnamon. <laughs> <laughs> and when he was, he Dramatic was cinnamon when I hugged music. him. And he was always equal parts you and me. That's why I loved him and, and wanted him. Because he was the love of the Hutch embodied. What? And now the thought, the thought of that child curdles me. Curdles me. Curdles you. I, Thank the benevolent God for being wiser than me. Because if a son existed now, I swear, I'd bash his brains against the goddamn radiator. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, it's called uh, it's called head and nose bottle love story. <laughs> and then she stands there. Wow. The host is great though here. She gets the applause. Yes. Oh. Standing there. Wonderful set. That was beautiful, Precious. <laughs> <laughs> that was beautiful, oh, Precious. precious. Oh, oh, it's the best show ever. They all just had dreams. They really did. It ran from 79 into the early 90s. I was but did anybody make it from this show? I can't think of no one, one name. I don't know any of these names. Pub public Access, New York. Uh, yeah. So who were they even getting at that point? Right. Yeah. Just these people. Just names that are—they kind of sound successful. Here's Sam Kinescope. What? <laughs> <laughs> Sam Kinescope. <laughs> ah, shit. Yep. Oh. Any? Uh, yeah. Th there's dancing. Uh, play the girl dancing. That one's pretty funny. Um, kind of hard to do on the radio, but uh, all right. well, you'll hear some great music. Great transitions. It's. She's awful. Oh, the makeup is so bad. Yeah, horrible makeup. She's wearing this glittery thing. And then she just does like this. She looks, she looks like she's squatting to take, take a, a shit. Take a shit. Exactly. She's uh, wearing a white hat, and she has like those weird like arm tassels. But she's eight. Yeah, I know. It's oh, terrible. Oh, is she a little kid? Oh. Yeah. Oh, this probably wasn't even the one. Oh, she's acting out like playing the music. All right. Oh, she can you sucks. imagine just doing this over and over? Yes, I can. She's mock oh. playing the piano. She's not really playing. I've never seen a less talented child. Oh, <laughs> horrible. They should, should do a where are they now with her. Oh. Oh, she's boogie. Oh, my God. She's, she's oh, terrible. Boom. This kid is she boogie. She had to wait for a second when the music didn't come on right away. Yeah. Oh, she's fucking abysmal. She's terrible. But, uh, all right, enough, enough God fucking bless her. dancing. And she's doing the a typical. Tap, I want to hear a tap dance. Tap moves. <laughs> oh, <she's laughs> Listen so to the music. This is like toddlers and tiaras. <laughs> oh, she's god awful. Yeah, she's got tinsel all over her arms. Wow. This is like that generic music they used to play on, like the Brady Bunch when they had to do something. Yeah. yeah. It's funny. Yes. This is like the opening. Oh, my and on god. and with weather. Yeah. Chad. <laughs> like when they had to rush. Mr. Brady to the hospital because he fainted. <laughs> they said, well, it must be hot. <laughs> Passed out again. He hit his head on his architecture uh, fucking board. Wow, is that He's bad? got strange bruises on him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a uh, stairway to stardom. What a great find. Oh, again, fantastic. <laughs> is there a... What about the ventriloquist? Oh, there's a ventriloquist, right? Yeah, I Can think so. Find that or... I wish I could find That's right. Yeah. There's a magician, a ventriloquist, um, 
Uh, a lot of singers and dancers. Oh, the puppet show is is fucking ponderous. That guy does Mac the Knife. That's got to be good. Oh, yeah. yeah I didn't see that. that one. Let's hear Mac the Knife. Yeah, that should be pretty good. All right. Tony Sanchez. Oof. They call him dirty. <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> he even has the mustache, green shirt. Yep. Oh, the shop <laughs> has such teeth. Damn. Damn. And it shows them them pearly white. Just a jackknife has old a Mac key. <laughs> Look at the flop sweat. <laughs> and it <laughs> keeps sweating. it out of sight. Imagine the stage manager trying to you be like, oh, you're in that shock. Then we got the dancer. Like, someone had to organize this. Yeah. That was such a, shit. That one's whatever. Yeah, he's actually staying on key. Yeah. It's terrible. Uh, Who's that? Another comedian? <laughs> Arthur's theme. Oh, oh no. Oh, wow. Look at this frump. <laughs> She's not pretty. No, it looked like a guy. Yeah. Your answer to his question was no. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> she looks like Alan Hunter. <laughs> <laughs> oh. She looks like the girl that ran the dropship in Aliens. Once We're in the pipe, in five by five. Find him. <laughs> Someone who turns your heart around, and next thing you know. You're closing down the town. <laughs> <laughs> Wake up and it's still with you. Uh, Even though your love is way across town. Like there's no reason she should be out <laughs> None! <laughs> she wants to sing in a backyard somewhere who gives a fuck. Yeah. When you get caught between the <laughs> moon and New York City. City! Oh. She's like Bonnie fucking Franklin. Yeah. Or, uh, no, not Bonnie Franklin. She looked like Bonnie Franklin, but she looked yes. like Bonnie Franklin. She looks like Bonnie Franklin. And the drummer is still just sitting there waiting to die. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, the drummer's like, oh, this is last gig. Yeah. He's got a fucking hi-hat and a snare. Yeah. And no ambition to be there. <laughs> the best that you can do so. is fall in love. Nice the camera's all close to her. I'd fuck her right in the mouth. <laughs> She's got peanut butter teeth. Anyone else notice that? It's horrible. It's horrendous. She really is bad. Oh, that was a good one. This is addicting, man. It really is. I couldn't stop. Oh, Wait, what's there. the guy with the beard on the left? Is he singing? Uh, He's a comedian. Oh, oh come we on. Love comedians. Richie Triolo? I know. I do know Richie. No, you don't. Yes, I do. I, I, Richie that name, Triolo is a buddy Richie, of mine. That, that name sounds very familiar. I don't yeah. know him. Yeah. Oh, Richie, let's, um, um, well, let's not. I've, he's a fucking muscular guy. I used to work with Richie. This hey, is let's no see. bullshit. It's early on, you know. Is he still doing it? You know, I don't know. I have not talked to Triolo in years, but Richie was a, honestly a buddy of mine. Oh, let's see if uh, he was any good back Richie in the day. Triolo, is that it? <laughs> oh, Shalomo. Thank you, Frank. That's him? Oh, yeah. This big fucking dude. How's everybody doing? Having a good time? <laughs> any Italians out there? Come on, let's see your raviolis. Show us your raviolis. I'm Italian. I was brought up by very strict Italian parents. And, uh, you know, the kind of religious Italian parents that if you go in the bedroom, they have a picture of God shaking hands with Frank Sinatra in the bedroom. <laughs> My father was very strict with us. Like, if we did something wrong, like we drew, drew hair on the St. Anthony statue and make him look like one of the Beatles, he would always smack us to a certain beat or rhythm that for every word he said, he had a smack like, I told you! Oh, yeah, oh my God! My father yeah, became my, dad did that. <laughs> my father became a contender. My mother was the athlete in the family. Like we did something wrong, she'd hide in the kitchen. She put on Jerry Cooney trunks, Jerry Cooney. a ripped bathrobe, and a mouthpiece, and wait for us to come in the kitchen. And she chased us around the table, like, "When I get a hold of you, you're gonna wish you were dead." I used to run in my room <sighs> and lock the door, and she'd come up to the door, open the door. I'm not gonna hit you. I know you're going to hit me, Mom. I know you're going to hit me. Open the door. I'm not going to hit you. Now, I waited for everything to get very quiet. I opened the door just to crack. She would put her hand through, <laughs> like the Frankenstein monster. <laughs> Pull me by my hair and give me a tour of the house. <laughs> one, one Holy year, she, shit! I will I say, like I've Gandhi. seen Richie have better shows. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've Holy seen him have much better shit. sets. <laughs> Uh, what was the answer? Uh, the oh. city was uh, city was doing a lot of things this past couple of weeks. What? And, uh, city was. Remember, they celebrated the 50th anniversary of the movie King Kong. 
one day I'm, I'm looking up, I see King Kong on the building. The next day I come back, I see this big brown thing stuck on the side. It looks like I climbed up, took a dump, <laughs> and left. <laughs> what are they going to do? <laughs> what are they going to do? <laughs> oh, kids eat. What are they going to do for the 50th anniversary of Deep Throat? <laughs> Have a giant mouth going up and down the building? <laughs> Craziness. And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> so rich. Craziness. Craziness. <laughs> Craziness. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit, this is so bad. No one's looking at each uh, other here in the room. It's uh, just... <laughs> well, Jimmy knows the guys. Uh, yeah, yeah. We're all just kind of peeking at Jim. Just yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, I'm, Jim. I'm wondering if it's okay. Yeah. Like, right. I'm, I'm sure Rich would not have positive things to say about this No, experience. it's one of those, you know, early on things that suck when you look back What year did them. King Kong come out? Because I want to see what year 39, this was. 39? 38? Yeah, 39? this happened in 82. Oh, 82? So wow. 50th. At, wait a minute. He was doing comedy. He was probably new in comedy then. Because I knew him in the early 90s. Of course it is. It would be 89 mm -hmm. would be the 50th anniversary. If it was that. Maybe his comedy wasn't factually correct. I remember when they put the King Kong on the outside of the oh my god Empire really? State Building. Yeah, it was a big blow up King Kong, and it lasted for like a couple of hours, and then it just deflated. <laughs> Why? I guess the wind fucked. They just it up. didn't have it figured out. Yeah, yeah. All right. Well, there you go. Stairway to Stardom. Yeah. There's a million of them. We could keep going. Oh, there there are a million of them. It's fucking fantastic. It's the best fucking viewing you'll you'll have. Mm. Yeah. Eighty two. I Google Richie Triola and it's just coming up stairway to stardom. There's no way you could be happy if the one the big... <laughs> That's it, huh? Yeah. Oh my god. That's mm. pretty bad. <laughs> I, I was just <laughs> I was so fucking uh taken by that last night. <laughs> Oh. oh. <laughs> That's what you got. If there's an Opie and Anthony TV show, yeah. you yeah. need to put on like an old school, yeah. cringe inducing public access show. Public access variety show How type thing. How great would that be? Fantastic. Very good. I've already Twittered, uh, texted myself. I might have to. Um, to do it? Yeah. Rethink uh, to do rethink what? a segment on the compound. <laughs> yeah, just to do an old school public access show, but then every now and then bring on like a really awesome. Good. <laughs> Someone awesome. Like, like it's just like bad yeah. act, bad act, and then Louis C.K. stops by or something. You know what's fucked up, though? This is the o this was the only place a person... There was no fucking YouTube. Right. You didn't have your own podcast and channels and shit. This you did. videos. No. They just weren't popular. No. <laughs> <laughs> so you were, st you were relegated to public access television. That was going to make you a star. That was your stairway to startup. Uh, because you, there was no other recourse for these people. They fucking. You want to be on TV? That's it. I actually liked Richie's joke about the fucking 50th deep third anniversary. A giant mouth on top of the Empire State Suck, Building. Sucking the Empire State like Building. It's a giant like cock, that? yeah, but then he just pat a bell on he went, craziness. <laughs> <laughs> craziness. 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 With that, we're going to take a break, and when we get back, we're going to introduce a brand new sponsor oh, to nice. the Opie and Anthony oh, yeah. Show. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. The Opie and Anthony Show. The Opie and Anthony Show. Sirius XM.